have a, an assorted haulage here. I got Ipsy, Tree, eBay, little garage sale stuff. This is my Ipsy thing I got. I never read these things, but they're cute. And the bag is extra pretty this month. I got, I don't need another one of these, but they sent me another black, really black eyeliner. I don't really use black anymore. This I'm interested to use, it's leave-in hair treatment. 12 in 1, made in USA. So I'll try that and report back. This is a cleansing gel, which I'll uh, give that to my mom. I'm scared to use this stuff. This is kind of neat. It's a NYX liquid illuminator. I haven't tried it yet, but it's kind of neat. You could just put that like on the tops of your cheeks. It's not cakey or anything. It's sort of glowy. And this is really pretty. I can't pronounce this word here. It's in London, but it's nail polish. And it's really, really pretty lavender polish. Look at that. Oh, I like the brush too. So that looks like a good deal. So that's what I got this month. Pretty good. Not crazy for this eyeliner, but that's all right. I'll pass it along. Then I went to the tree. I've never tried these. These are Yoohoo mini bars. I'm going to take these tonight. Let me go to dinner. See if anybody likes them. Then, oh, this is for Mr. Retros. It's some Tums and a little uh, tube thing. You know, it's, it's, sometimes it's hard to find Tums. I don't know what's going on, but these are actual Tums. So this I'm gonna try. It's a menthol inhaler. Sometimes when we're traveling south, I get all stuffed up around Tacoma and Olympia. I don't know what it is. I'll try this. And Necros, love these. Those are for my trip too. They had this Elf, and let's dig this out and look at it. Long-lasting, lustrous eyeshadow. Oh, we'll see. Is it all dried up? That's not bad. It's kind of gold. Not bad. We'll give that a shot. And this coconut oil moisturizer. It's got vitamin E. So I'll try. It'd be good at, you know, you can try it on your feet and your legs. You know, if nothing else. It's worth a buck. We'll see. And I couldn't resist these solar critters. Look at this elephant with the bongos. It's extra nice. Look at that. There you go. And here's a giraffe playing a saxophone. And then I guess she's just doing a little dance number here. This little blue hippo. Super cute. These just came out this week, I think. And they had them all. So those are neat. In my eBay haul. They, these earrings are cool. Let me see if I can open them. They're a ball instead of a, you know, like a stopper or a back. You get this ball thing. So you have a ball in front, this ball in front, and then you close it, lock it with this ball in back. And it's got little skulls on it. But they're kind of cool. I have some other ones like this. I kind of like them. And these were like 99 cents shipped. I got some pans for this that you just put, they're magnetic and you just pick out whatever colors. I bought this set and popped them in there and they're really nice. They're pretty. Then I got these fakey, the balm, which is really nice. I don't think this is actually it, but it came from China and they were like, Five dollars or something. They've got good colors. And they're not bad. Actually, not that bad. And then this one is the other one. Yeah, these are these aren't bad. This one's kind of neat. And they're nice matte finish. I have. I cleared out a lot of my shadows. I have an embarrassing excess of shadows. So I did some purging yesterday. That's the story on them. 
Then I got this stuff. This is a tint that you put on at night before you go to bed and you paint it on your eyebrows. It looks really weird and kind of grotto marxy. This is the light brown. And then let's see, it goes it's like this stuff. Let's see, it's kind of going. It's, you can paint it on, it's not hard. And then the next morning you peel it off and it tints your brows for like three days. I, I really like it because I hate drawing. I have bald spots in my eyebrows. And spend more time doing these stupid eyebrows than anything else. So this saves me about 15 minutes. And they're like $1.99 on eBay. Shipped. So cool, I'm not. Then garage sale haul. I got a, I don't have it here, but I got a Haywood Wakefield coffee table for $20. It needs refinishing, but. $20 is pretty good. That's a small one I can use in here. This I got this beautiful pig cup. Look at, it's from made in England. Look at this free. Look at that nice pig. Jim, check it out. And same sale. I got this 50 cents. It's a candle holder thing by 180 degrees brand. But it's really fun looking. It's kind of like, a, I don't know, a monkey tiki. So, oh, yes, yeah, a monkey. See the curly tail? Yes. So that was 50 cents. Yeah. And then another sale. I got this little thing of 50 cents. A little tiny, this one's about dead. Vintage mini perfumes. That's Lancome. O O S E. Guy La Roche. This is uh, Anise Anise by Chaparral. I don't know what this one is. Um, I can't remember. Paco Rabanne. Looks like it. Lancome. This looks like Lair du Temps. I think this is something else. I can't read it. I can't read that one. It's so small. And this is Estee Lauder, which I, I'm allergic to Estee Lauder. But that's kind of neat to have all these little teeny ones. So any old who, that's my quick haul for today. It's hot here. Hope it's not too hot where you are. Bye-bye.